We always tend to think of a ceratopsian as a huge lumbering horned animal of a dinosaur. But what if I was to tell you there was actually a small little cousin of them? Today we are talking about Protoceratops, a small little ceratopsian dinosaur that you guys may find very adorable, as I do too. Protoceratops was discovered first by photographer James Bay Lane Shackle Ford in the Gobi Desert as part of the 1922 U.S. expedition looking for human ancestors, led by Roy Chapman Andrews. In 1923, Walter Granger and W.K. Gregory described the species P. Andrusky in honor of Andrews. In 1971, a fossilized velociraptor was found clutched around a protoceratops, and they died fighting, showing a rivalry between the two, one that is still iconic to this day. In 2001, a second species was found, actually. P. Helena Corinus, I believe I'm pronouncing it right, was found in the Bayan Mandua Formation in Inner Mongolia, which is in China. It had a slightly different fill from Andrusi and was larger and more robust in its jugular horns. In 2007, uh, Protoceratops was first found in 1965, preserved with its own footprint, the first of its kind. Now diving into more of the details of the Protoceratops itself, Protoceratops andrusi is in the Protoceratosidae family from the Cretaceous 75 to 71 million years ago. Protoceratops was the smallest ceratops in about 5.9 feet in length and about 2 feet high. And a fully grown one could weigh about 182 pounds. Smaller have been estimated to be about 52 pounds. The frill was thought to be used to protect the neck or even for mating. The jaws are capable of a powerful bite that were filled with actually dozens of teeth. So despite what people may think, it's not just a bee. And of course, protoceratops, like other ceratopsins, were thought to be in herds due to the massive amount of them found altogether. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode diving into protoceratops, a fun little guy. I first fell in love with protoceratops uh, in Dinotopia, and I'm going to include a video, a little picture in there talking about it now. But oh, Peck was awesome. So, or Bix. Peck, Bix was awesome. And man, Dinotopia is a great book. You go check out Dinotopia. It's not about Dinotopia right now. But, 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 I fell in love there. If anybody knows where I can get a Bix plushie, let me know in the comments down below or something like that through social media. Thanks, everybody. Make sure you guys subscribe for more science videos for Dino Times, covering paleontology, interviews and such for Dino Times, as well as video games I do on the channel, which are uncensored but fun. And, of course, you know, toy reviews, all that jazz like that, whatever it may be, podcasts, click the notification bell so you get alerted whenever I put up a new video. I'm on Twitter at Dakota Morgan 3 Instagram at Dakota underscore Morgan 97 and, of course, Twitch, CodaRex97. Thanks, everybody. And, of course, remember these wise words, science is real.